What is poppin' everyone? It's Big Bad with another video. Today we are going to run another infinite cooldown mod, and this time it's going to be the 555 Ultimate Cross Path uh, Mortar Monkey. Now we actually already ran a Mortar Monkey, but um, that one was only the top path, and I realized that uh, the Cross Path version actually doesn't cause too much lag. And we have been getting some requests for Bloon Cineration, so I figured, well, this is probably the best way to do it. Uh, it's going to be pretty OP, I think. That's my guess, is it? It'll be pretty OP. Alright, and we have Sada down. We're gonna do our new farming method of the Sniper. Here we go. It's gonna need a supply drop. There we go. Alright, that's pretty much all we need, and we just need the tech bot attached to it, and it should start uh, giving us money real quick. There we go. And it starts getting crazier and crazier and crazier. Alright, <laughs> that is all we need. There we go, that is a fat amount. We can get rid of Sada, take off the auto start, and we can start testing out this mortar monkey. Now, as you guys know, I kind of failed you yesterday. I was, I was gonna upload more videos, but... I ended up going to bed. My sleep schedule is really, really bad. Um, I tried to take a nap. The nap turned into me just falling asleep altogether. Um, but we're up early today, actually, and full of energy, finally. So today, we should have three videos up. I'm going to record this one and another one uh, right now. I'm probably going to do a third one maybe later, but I might do it right after. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. Okay, auto start is off. So we just need to upgrade this all th three times. There we go. Attach the tech bot to it. And let's just go to round 300, get this started and see how it does. Let's do this. And of course it looks ridiculous. As you guys know, just the bomb spam looks insane. And he's not getting any, okay, I was gonna say he's not getting any pops. I'm wondering where everything is. But no, he is, he is. It's just the balloons are coming out pretty slow because it is only round 300. They'll start coming out faster with the later rounds, of course. And as you can see, his ability is getting spammed right now. Um, thankfully, this ability actually doesn't cause too much lag. Most, well, I don't know about most, but a lot of abilities cause lag. That's for sure. A lot of abilities cause lag. Thankfully, this one does not. All right. Let's skip forward to round... Let's do 600. Let's do round 600. Just to test it. Let's see. Okay, so far so good. 10 million pops per second easily. Uh, it looks like uh, nothing's really getting past that much at all. Uh, nothing's really moving. This thing has the whole track on lockdown. And I bet you it has the infinite splash damage as well. Which is perfect. Uh, the other mortar did, so I have no reason to assume that this one wouldn't. So, this one is going to be very very powerful i don't know what my guess is to where or how long it'll last my guess is probably at least 4,000, but possibly more than that we'll see it's handling 600 extremely well that's for sure all right if we speed it up enough it just literally like his projectiles just go away and we just see the fire <laughs> look at this that's just the blue incineration fire that's ridiculous or whatever it whatever it's from whatever it's from the uh, signal flare maybe i don't know all right let's do round let's just double it let's do round 1200 this is good this is a pretty big jump okay things are getting past a little bit that's actually kind of not good to be honest um but we'll see we'll see so far still uh pretty good um they didn't get too far past and it looks like they're Getting destroyed earlier so maybe it's like these flames that are stopping them earlier so maybe the first one might get past slightly um, if that's the case that's kind of bad news because we've seen things do that before and the first one is well like the first balloon that gets past like that tends to kind of like ruin the whole thing uh, because everything else gets defeated but when balloons are moving so fast first one just gets passed before it gets gets destroyed because without the fire it's not as strong that's my guess though that's my guess okay, let's speed it up a little bit okay we could see the balloons now because the explosions are not in the way 
All right, he's getting a lot of pops per second really quick. It's pretty nice, pretty nice. Everything's looking pretty good. Um, by the way, the next video I'll probably do is... Probably the Inferno Ring. Probably the Inferno Ring. Let me see if that's the name. <laughs> yeah, the Inferno Ring. I always, like, get the names and stuff wrong. That's why I always have to check. I always forget. Alright. Let's just double the round once again. So, 2,400. And let's see. Okay. That's pretty bad. That's pretty bad that those balloons got that far. But they're not getting as far um, anymore. So, like I said, it seems like it's the first balloon or two that does. Uh, but once the flames are down, it seems like not as much. That's just my guess. And we're probably not going to double it. We're probably just going to go to around 3,600. So, we'll just go up by 1,200 once again. And hopefully, it can last past that. And without the explosions, we can see what's going on. His pop count is pretty it's going up pretty quick. Now we are sped up a lot. Let's see what it looks like without it sped up. Okay. A few hundred a few hundred million. A few hundred million, that's pretty good. Alright. So far so good. Everything's looking pretty fine. Those flames are really just destroying anything that touches them. That's really nice. Hopefully, um, the explosions themselves can handle things on round 3,600. Let's check Let's check this right now. All right, 3,600. Let's do it. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, thank goodness. Okay, at least he's powerful enough to defeat them before they get past. And they got further, so... I do think he's going to beat 4,000. Based on that, I definitely think it's going to beat 4,000. But will it get too much further? I don't know. The real the real question is if it's going to be able to beat round 5,000. That's what I'm guessing. Should we just try 5,000 after this? Yeah, let's try 5,000 after this. And if he can't beat it, then we'll, we'll uh, upgrade him for those 100 rounds. And, uh... From there, we will try it again, because as you guys know, the more we upgrade it, it actually does make it better, the more and more we do. So I kind of set somewhat of a standard of doing it by 100 rounds, just so that we can kind of be consistent through the videos. Some videos I did it for more than 100, but um, for the most part, that's what we do, uh, because the video might take too long, or um, we don't want to be inconsistent, so we can actually compare that uh, these towers and how good they are. But this is looking pretty good. Pretty good. Now, the fortified bats with the fire and explosions, they're still getting by about 25% of the way. So we can tell that his time is coming soon. The round that he can last to is getting pretty close. All right. We're almost done. We're almost done. There we go. Now, let's just do 5,000. Let's see. I'll be surprised if he could beat 5,000, but let's see. Uh-oh, that's bad. Okay, he cannot beat 5,000. So, if that's the case, we're going to go back to round, uh, I would say one, but actually, can we do one? Let's put zero. Yeah, we can do one. Okay, so once it passes 100 rounds, I will come back and we'll test it out once again. So, give me one second. All right, we are back. We did 100 rounds, so let's try round 5,000 once again and see if it can beat it now. Probably. Let's see. Okay, yeah. See, the upgrades definitely still um, add a lot. It just depends on how much you do. The more you do, it still adds on. I wonder if there is a limit. I don't know, but if there is a limit, we have never reached it yet, and we have upgraded a tower over 500,000 times. I know, that's still a lot <laughs> uh, we've done that and it hasn't ever like not made them stronger so I think the limit if there is a limit it's much much higher probably we would have to see if it's like a million or more than that or maybe this number right here I don't know uh, but yeah I'm not sure I'm not sure but this round should be over pretty soon uh, we're getting a lot of pops per second. If we took off the speed, probably be like about a billion pops per second, which is pretty ridiculous, of course. And, and I like seeing the ability go off. Um, we actually could like 
run this tower with the infinite or no cooldown with that ability up. Um, the only reason I haven't is just because like, yeah, it kind of sucks. Like, <laughs> um, if we didn't have the the level up ability on, it would probably it would be spamming it, and there'd just be like these like constant white circle explosions that you couldn't see through or anything. And um, it would look cra it looks crazy, but it's not actually like super powerful. All right, let's let's skip forward to. We should skip forward 1,500 rounds. Let's do 6,500. It's pretty big. Oh, okay, so it's beating this round. That is actually impressive. So this tower is actually really strong. That's good, that's really good. So it's doing really well. Okay, and um, somebody commented about um, if I'm going to make a Discord. I do plan on making one in the future, uh, the issue is that I'm pretty new to Discord, I don't use it too much, like I've only really started to use it this year, and when, like, how I do use it is like very, very limited, sometimes I'll just go on a call with some friends, or um, I, I'll use it to go into a server to download these mods, and other than those two things, I pretty much don't use it, I've never ran a Discord, uh, I don't know that much about it. So I'm going to have to actually do some research and stuff before I can do that. But um, yeah, that will be coming in the future at some point. All right, so the round is going pretty well. Uh, no balloons are appearing anymore. All right, that's pretty good, pretty good. Um, and if you guys heard some squeaking just now, I don't know if you did because I do have like a noise canceling thing in the background, but um, yeah, uh, my dog was <laughs> uh, playing with her toy and it was uh, squealing real loud. That's why it was quiet for a second, because I had to uh, stop that. Um, but let's do round 8,000. Okay. Okay, it's beating 8,000 too. This, this is actually getting pretty impressive. This is actually getting pretty impressive and making this one of the strongest towers we've ran. So that's actually really nice. So let's skip, let's like fast forward a little more if we can. That's what kind of sucks is like, I wish we can actually skip forward, like not skip forward, but like fast forward a lot. Um, but you know, these kinds of things cause a little bit of lag, makes the speed that we fast forward a little slower than it should be. Like um, the round should pretty much be over if it was at full speed, but it's not because it, it's lagging slightly, um, but at least the good thing is it's not really lagging that much. That's at least the good thing. All right, so that was pretty quick. Let's do round 10,000. This is impressive it can beat it, if it can beat it, which I think it can, but let's see. Okay, I said I think it can, but we'll see. Oh my gosh, it can't, I was wrong. Okay, let's do 9,500. Let's do 9,500. Oh, no, it still can't. Okay, let's do round 9,000. I think it'll beat 9,000. Let's see. Okay, yeah, it's beating 9,000. This will probably be the last round we try, you guys. Uh, I don't want to make the video too long. We already upgraded 100 times. So we know it dies or it, like loses the game somewhere between 9,000 and 9,500. Um, so that's a pretty good... Um, uh, a pretty good, like, uh, gauge as to where this tower is in the rankings and stuff. It's a lot better than most towers we've ran. That's, that's the good part, is it's better than a lot of the towers we ran. Um, it's definitely a, a high tier tower for sure. Not in the top three, but top five maybe? And top ten for sure. For sure top ten. Um, I don't, I actually don't know if we've ran ten towers with this, probably, but... It's pretty high. It's pretty high. It's doing really, really well. This was a good recommendation. And as always, guys, recommend what towers you want to see in the comments. Some future towers are going to run is the Inferno Ring and the Vengeful True Sun God. And um, you guys should leave your comments. Let me know what else you want to see. If it has an ability, chances are it might cause some lag. Not all of them do. As you can tell, this one didn't. Um, but there's a lot that do. So just keep that in mind, if it has an ability, the chances of me being able to run it are a little lower. Um, but other than that, um, 
there's not too much that can be a problem. We're also going to run the spike factory at some point. And let's run around that will beat us so we can just check out our stats real quick. So let's do 10,000 and be quick. All right. Uh, but yeah, let me know. Uh, leave a like, leave a comment, leave a dislike if you don't like it, um, and subscribe. All right, let's see. Pop count, one trillion pops, which is very good. And abilities used, 207,000. That's actually quite a bit, quite a bit. Moab's pop, blah, 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 cash generated, this ridiculous number. All right, you guys, I'll catch you in the next video. Bye.